wonder why we take cool skins off. And this was a bit of a drama to get off. You come and have a look at that. This is why we take the skin off. That's uh, quite a bit of a uh, bit of rust under there. Uh, this will all get dealt to and uh, treated properly. Now, if we bought a good door, we're pretty unlikely to try and take this stuff off um, because you're not going to pull apart a good door. This wasn't a good door, so that is a good reason why um, it should pull apart. Thank you, extensive uh, panel beating repairs too. It was quite badly dented in. It had about half an inch or so of bog in it. Um, it looked probably finished in the photos but it really it wasn't uh, and this is what we're addressing now is the final metal finishing. If you have a look um, you can see uh, all the dimpling from the uh, person before us that just got a hammer and smashed it all in and bogged it up. So what we're doing is I'm using a uh, slightly crowned uh, palm dolly using my horse hoof file and what we're doing is and I'll just rest on the blanket is we'll just that up enough that you can now see that's starting to bring those low spots up. I then get my trusty uh, shrinking disc. Give it a quick go over, have a bit of a feel of it and make sure that it's um, going in the right direction. I'll spend a few hours doing this. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. This is the door that I've been uh, metal finishing. I've probably got in actual panel beating um, about three, maybe four hours uh, tops to get it to this stage. And uh, it comes along pretty quickly, mostly because uh, as a panel beater, I'm pretty used to doing this stuff. There's a slight little um, bit of daylight here and there, which we can still dress that up and that'll come up reasonably quickly or it won't. We don't know. It's just, you just, Keep at it until um, until it's some come up good. This was really badly pushed in. You can see that score dent through there. That was pushed in a good half an inch, and that's pretty much up level too. A lot of shops would simply run a bit of uh, filler over the top of this, and while it will still get a skim coat at some stage or high build primer, it won't get much. Um, it probably won't need even that. I'm just going to keep on trying for metal finishing. Okay, thanks for watching.